it seems to me so many people are taking precautions for this sickness that is going around the world and you may know what I am speaking of. But how many people are concerned about their afterlife? How many people are preparing themselves to go to heaven? Even if that sickness does kill us, can it do any harm to us in the next realm? No. I don't think so, unless, I don't think so. So what use is it to be so concerned about that sickness and not really care about following the rules of God that apply to us? Like, why care so much about this world but have little thoughts, I guess, or maybe I should say little concern about your spiritual life, as in a relationship with God? What is more important, that sickness or going to heaven? Some people may be buying a whole bunch of toilet paper and hand sanitizer and buying up a lot of food. What use is that if your life isn't anchored in God? Please listen to what I am saying. Why is this sickness here now? Some people may say, well, it is man-made and, you know, the elites and all this stuff here. But who made this world? How can something come to us unless God allowed it? And you may say, and I believe God allowed it. And you may say, Kevin, why do you believe God allowed it? I believe he allowed it because I think so many people in this world is ignoring him. So if you are buying a whole lot of toilet paper, food, and supplies, how about anchor your life in God if you haven't? Follow his rules that apply to us. Read the Bible, pray fast, do things to please him. And I believe if we all or the majority of us do it, I believe stuff like this probably would not happen. Or I believe so or if it does happen, maybe not on this scale. So you may be preparing yourself earthly, but are you preparing yourself spiritually? What use is toilet paper and food and hand sanitizer and this and that if you go to hell afterward? It's like you looking over diamonds. How can I say this? It's like you are stepping over diamonds and picking up rocks. Like you are focusing on the insignificant things and not really paying attention to what is most important. Listen now. 
give your life to God. I believe this sickness is not a coincidence. I guess if you are afraid of this sickness and if you are not serving God, I guess you have a very good reason to be afraid. But if you are serving God, well, let me not say that. So I pray that all of this makes sense to you. Turn your life to God. Why prepare yourself for this sickness on earth and not prepare yourself for the next realm? Makes no sense. And honestly, and you may get mad at me if I say this or when I say this, I think this sickness that came to us or came in this world is a good thing. And you may say, how can you say that, Kevin? I believe what is going on now, I think it has slowed down people's lives. I think so many people were so focused on their life, on trying to do this, trying to do that, working, whatever else. I think many people have to be at home or maybe not be so active. And I think that is giving some people some time to really focus on what is really important in life. And hopefully, hopefully, Hope, hopefully, their mind will lead them to God. If you understand what I am trying to tell you, let me stop here. God bless you.